Hi, I'm Allie Dazdle with We Are Member Keepers, and I'm here at scrapbook.com to share a lesson on using the Typecast typewriter in a traveler's notebook. So first of all, I wanted to show you three different ways that you can use the typewriter to add journaling to your projects. The first way is that you can actually type on a photograph, and I've done that right here, and I'm gonna show you how to do that on the machine. The second way is on a tag, that you can actually roll your tags right through the typewriter and type directly on them, which makes it really easy. And then the last thing I wanna show you is how to use the different color ribbons um, to emphasize um, important words in your journaling, and that just adds a nice fun touch to your journaling in your project. So you can use pretty much any photo you want. I've got Instax, you could use a four by six photo, um, whatever you'd like. And you're going to just roll this down through the typewriter and make sure that it gets underneath this bar that will hold it in place. Let's get that over. And then what I like to do is I like to use these margin guides to make sure that I don't accidentally type off of my project. And I'm just gonna roll this down. And I, I usually try to type over a spot on the photo that's kind of um, clear and plain so that there's not a lot of stuff to um, jumble up with the letter so you can read it clearly. And I'm just gonna go ahead and type right on here. And then one more line. And then I just pull it out. So you can see this was um, a picture from Old Faithful Geyser. And I've just gone ahead and typed the location where we were right there on the photo. And that is an easy way to add journaling and details to your project. So the second way you're gonna add journaling to your project with the typewriter is by typing directly onto a journaling tag. That just makes it really easy rather than trying to put this through your printer and line it up exactly where you want on the tag. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put this in. And we're gonna roll it through. Place it up here under the bar. And we're gonna use these margin guides again to make sure we don't type off the tag accidentally. And then we're gonna line up the journaling lines right with these guidelines on the typewriter. Okay, and then we're gonna type some details from the trip. Okay, so now you can see um, the, how easy it is to just add those details using the typewriter onto your journaling tags. The third way to add journaling with the typewriter is by using different color ribbons to emphasize important words in your journaling. I've got the teal and black ribbon in and I'm gonna go ahead and just add another sentence here to finish this off and I'll show you how it works. So again, we just run this through the typewriter, place it under the bar, and if it's crooked, you can use this lever here that kind of loosens up your paper so you can shift it around if you need to to get it nice and straight. And then I'm gonna wind it to the very bottom. And then I'm gonna set my margins by moving the typewriter over so that it's lined up with the rest of these margins. And then I'm just gonna push this down and over and it'll stop when it's hit the margin there. And just scoot this over so I don't type off of my paper. And then I'm ready to start. So the sentence is, I love you more than words can describe, and I wanna emphasize love. So I'm gonna just type normal black. This is your lever here that changes from black to color. So I've got that on black, and then I'm just gonna type I, and then for love, I'm gonna switch this up to the color. I'm even gonna put on caps lock, so it's all caps. And then I'm gonna take that off and put it back on black and finish my sentence. There, you get the idea that that just emphasizes those words. It adds a little interest to your journaling, a little color, and it's really fun to do and easy to do. Um, one thing I wanted to point out about the typewriter is um, it's important to remember this is not like a keyboard. Um, it's a manual typewriter, it's not electric, so you need to make sure that you use a lot of pressure when you push down on those keys so you get some clear typing on your projects. So I wanted to show you some more of the pages from my traveler's notebook um, and just point out some of the fun products that are in the paper collection. 
Um, there's tags with beautiful um, rose gold accents that you can type on. They've also made stickers that you can type directly onto. And all you have to do is roll the sheet right through and line it up on the sticker that you want to type your journaling onto and then peel the sticker and place it on. So that's super easy. Also in the paper collection, there's two paper pads and those paper pads include a lot of fun papers that you can cut apart that are lined um, that have got journaling cards or tags that you can cut apart. So that really um, gets you a lot of mileage out of your paper. So thanks for joining me in this lesson all about the Typecast typewriter and how to add interesting journaling with it to your traveler's notebook. I hope to see you in the next lesson.